Among the last sights the First Lady saw in Europe before flying back to Washington were some of the most inspiring, the noble ruins of Athens' Acropolis. Here she visits the Parthenon, one of the glories of all architecture. It was in Athens that she first learned through Greek newspapers of the injury to the president's back, an injury which fortunately was not serious enough to curtail her visit to this cradle of democracy. At Tati Palace, home of Greece's royal family, Mrs. Kennedy with her brother-in-law and sister, Prince and Princess Raziwell, are guests of the king and queen. Mrs. Kennedy tells her host she wants to bring her children for a vacation in Greece next summer. The First Ladies of America and Greece, Jacqueline Kennedy and Queen Frederica. An earlier cruise among the Aegean Isles with plenty of swimming and water skiing made the stay in Greece a relaxation after the formalities of Paris and Vienna and London. Mrs. Kennedy calls it an unbelievable and unforgettable experience that gave her a profound sense of admiration for the Greek people.